You can take an entire course including topics in this video through our website and get a certificate of completion from RASAF, the online educational radio frequency institute located in Irwan, California. Instructions and coupon for taking this course is provided at the end of this video. In this part, we are going to talk about radio frequency. Radio frequency or RF is any of electromagnetic wave frequencies that lie in the range starting from around 3 kHz to 300 GHz. As you see, it's starting from intermediate frequency and ends in really high frequency. What is the purpose of using RF field? We say RF field can be used for various types of wireless broadcasting and communication. So we use transmitters and receivers and also antennas in order to send and receive data and communicate. What are the applications? We can say there are lots of applications for radio frequency, cell phones, radio, television, Wi-Fi, and even if we go more advanced, we can have satellite communications. This picture shows the RF system in a very simple way. So imagine that we have two devices, one and two, so they are trying to communicate and talk with each other. So, so they are sending and receiving these waves and they have their data inside these waves. So as you see these electromagnetic waves have the radio frequency. So there are two cases in the system that we have to study. First, we can say, for example, this device can only send data and this the second one can only receive it. So this one is sending and it's in one direction. So and this one is receiving. So we can say this is a transmitter, so this is TX, we call it TX, and this is receiver, so this is RX. And it can be also different case, for example, these two systems can be TX and RX at the same time. It means that this device can send electromagnetic wave to the second one and also receive from second one. So this time, this is TX, RX. And we are going to talk about this in upcoming lectures. There are two points we have to be careful in RF system. First one is these systems are trying to communicate with the waves that have RF frequency. So we say we have radio frequency here, RF. And second one is these two systems are not connected to each other physically. There are no connection between them. Uh, physically with a wire for example so we say the system is wireless the RF spectrum is divided into several range or bands with the exception of lowest frequency segment each band represents an increase of frequency corresponding to an order of magnitude so we are going to explain the RF spectrum in the following table and uh, as you see in this picture, we can see, we can divide the RF uh, frequency range into different groups. So we start with very low frequency, it's from 9 kilohertz to 30 kilohertz. And it goes to a uh, low frequency and uh, the, it goes on and we reach the extremely high frequency. Here is from 30 gigahertz to 300 gigahertz. So we call this a spectrum, as you see the range is divided into different categories and uh, we most of the time allocate this uh, range to different kind of applications we are going to show in next slide and what about the wavelengths we have to explain the wavelengths here because we are going to use it we say the wavelengths is equal to speed of light over the frequency of oscillation so wavelengths is lambda here we show it with lambda is proportional to inverse our frequency. It means that if we increase our frequency, we are reducing the wavelengths. So as you see here, the wavelengths for low frequency range is really high, starting from 10 to 3, 33 kilometer. But when we are increasing our frequency, we have a very low wavelengths. As you see here, it's a millimeter. So that's, that's why we call this millimeter wave, this point. We are going to explain the wavelengths. Imagine that there's a water and you are trying to tap in the middle of this water. So you are producing wave. So what is the wavelengths here? As you see, if you see the cross section of the water, it's like this. So the wavelengths is the 
length between the two peaks of the wave. So, for example, wavelength is here. This is the lambda here. We can show it lambda. This is the length between two peaks of the wave. And uh, the relationship between wavelengths and frequency is shown in this picture. As you see, uh, for the first wave, we have the frequency of F1. For the second, we have the frequency of F2. And we say F1 is higher than F2. Uh, but as you see, this one has the short wavelength. So we say lambda 1 is lower than lambda 2. So this shows the relationship between the wavelengths and frequency. Hey guys, thank you for watching the entire video. I'm going to provide you with a coupon for taking our fundamental basic concepts and components, RA RF101. So you can uh, get this course from our website. If you call the page, you just have to select the buy this course and register here. As you see, if you're not registered up to now. So you need your username, email, password, and also you have to answer a security question. And then you can uh, press the uh, register button, uh, press the sign up button, and uh, you will be able to uh, register in our website. Then after that, all you need to uh, do is going to the, the course landing page and uh, go to checkout. And as you see, click to enter your code. You can put the, the coupon code here and then apply the coupon. So then you will have this course for free and you can uh, take this course. As you see, you won't pay anything for this course. Rasoft has one of the most complete online certificate in radio frequency available which covers practical topics needed to be a knowledgeable RF engineer. Since all courses are consulted closely by design engineers and pioneers whom have worked as RF engineers in top RF companies such as Qualcomm, Broadcom, Skyworks, Intel and Apple as well as avionic companies. It covers the necessary information to land a job or successful in your career. Your first step to take the prerequisite course, RAH RF101, which we have provided the free coupon for it, RFPREREQ101. See you there shortly.